Right, just a recap from uh, before from the TX videos. I've already assembled this one pretty much. So just a bit of a talk through. So remember, trim the eyes out roughly, small Dremel. Finish them off with a little sanding disc. Flat disc inside for these when you've got the hammer disassembled. Your little file to clean out the teeth nicely. Brow rubber on, three rows of magnet set, keep it, rivet. Let's say properly, you should have the two, but I always find that one gets in my way, so I just put the one. I've already trimmed that ear, so don't worry too much about gaps because the originals had gaps. This ear is all trimmed, ready to fix on. Ears are the worst part for people, so just another demonstration again, just with this other one here. Trim it out with your legs and scissors first. Cut off the excess there, so keep trimming in if you don't want to do it all in one hit. So I've got like 8mm left there. Come in with the bottom first. Now ignore the scoop at first, just go straight from there, straight up to the side. If you feel your scissors getting tight, lose that little bit there. Now I want to go 10mm all the way around this disc. If you want to go 12 make sure that you take it back nicely so you get a pucker fit and do so. I want to mark a little line around there. Coming into here, follow the shape, take it back from that way. Now we've got that off, we can do the same on that side. Just take the minimum off from the mould line and just be left with that. Plastic still on. You can trim all this to suit, just keep Gently filing, I only need a couple of millimetres out, not a lot. You see. Drill your holes in them, get your countersink, mine's are out a bit. Deburr it so you get a slight countersink to fit the side of your screw that you're using. Not too much, you don't want to pull them through. So again, when we get to that stage, hold them nice where you want them. So, roughly in line with the black. Two in there. Washer. Nut. Washer, nut, nice and tight. Pinch them in. Don't get too mad. Don't want to buckle it. Get that one sitting as you want it. Drill. Sometimes it feels like you could need three hands, so get someone to help. Nipper up. Right now it's a neck cutting. It wasn't the TX video, but it got cut short. Right, so we want to continue this flow around 
from there give us about 10 mil to the ear. So keep that coming round. And then straight off at the front. Don't lose your bulges too much here. But you don't want to leave it too short for the neck hole. And as always, you have to put these lids on sideways because of the shape of this. So bring that back in to the back cap. Make sure it looks pretty even. Want a little bit of a adjustment, just keep it trimming. That's it. Chop those little corners off in there. I don't like little sharp corners. seal, actually a plastic out of the way, got a fat side and a thin side, make sure you get it sitting so it's bending how it wants to and you've got the thin edge, start in the middle, make sure that cuts nice as well, it's a bit of a dodgy cut we got there. Start in the middle, and work your way around, pushing it in nice and tight. Make sure you're on properly. to the back, cut it a bit longer, probably 5 mil, so that you can really squeeze that last bit in there. You might want to mess around and tr keep trimming and tickling it until you get a, a really good little fit there. And make sure you do it longer so you really it's forcing against itself. Get rid of the plastic, get rid of the magnets, sliding the inside ones. Mic tips, these little ones, you can get all different sorts, these ones need drilling, so I need my 3.5mm drill bit, drill directly in the centre of them. these in the centre there, pointing nice. Drill them off. Get these little dome heads. Pop them in. And just nip them up so it pulls the back plastic in with the washer just nice. Don't over tighten them, just just two for it to stop. Like that. I'm not gonna bore you with the other one because I'm gonna run out of video again. Right, so you want to set them both up like that. These need to be painted before you put them. You then need to, with these ones, there's little nipples that come with it. You need to glue them inside there so you see the little